Yeah. You, you don't want. What? What's this that? This is a good, very, very, very good message. I'm a very Catholic person. I read at church the whole bit. Have you ever prayed to the Virgin Mary? Absolutely. Without a doubt. I'm Catholic. What? Praise the Lord Jesus Christ on tonight. The Bible says, For it's once on upon a man to die, and after that is the judgment. Jesus Christ, who is the true and the living God, is commanding all men to be saved. He's calling for the legend to be saved tonight. He's calling for the one that dealing with wickedness. He's calling for you to be saved tonight. Why would you die in your wickedness when you can be saved? You can be born again. You can be blood washed. The Bible said, though they've been baptized in Christ, put on Christ. Many times, people in the night, they putting on this, they putting on that. What about putting on Christ? Putting on his righteousness. The Bible said, your righteousness is a filter rags. And I don't know about you, but I throw filter rags away. I can't use them anymore. That's how your righteousness is sealed. You must be blood washed, and he's calling all men to be saved. The scripture says this, hallelujah, he wants weak at our ignorance. Thing that we were doing, and we didn't know nothing about him. Oh, but now he's calling all men to repentance. Repent and believe the true gospel of our Lord and Savior. Oh, he says on the night to spread the gospel. The gospel of our Lord and Savior. Mark 16 and 15. Say hallelujah. Go into all the world and preach the gospel. So everyone oh, you saved tonight, do you know your creator? Or are you seeking a creation? Oh, many people, they're seeking a creation. And they wonder why they don't have peace. They wonder why they don't have rest. Because they're seeking the creation. Why don't you come and seek the creator tonight? Maybe you need prayer tonight. The scripture said that man ought to always pray and never faint. The first prayer of a righteous man, it availeth much. Oh, are you in right standing with Jesus Christ? Who is the true and the living God? He told you to come and blow the trumpet in Zion to let people know that the ways of sin is death. Oh, but the gift of God is eternal life. You don't have to die in your sin. You don't have to die separated from the true and the living God. Oh, the Bible says all souls are mine, but the soul that sinned, it shall surely die. Oh, he's calling for you tonight. He's calling for the homosexual tonight. He's calling for the lady tonight. He's calling for the drag queen tonight. He's calling for you tonight to come to him. Come and surrender your life unto him on tonight. Oh, tonight is the night of salvation. What is salvation? Oh, many people don't know what salvation is. They think salvation means to go down to an altar and say a Roman 10 and 9 scripture and think they're going to save them. Oh, they're not what's going to save you. You must be blood washed. You must take on the name of Jesus Christ. Oh, many have been baptized in Christ. Put on Christ. Oh, why don't you put on Jesus Christ? Why don't you come to him? Come to the true and the living God. He can give you rest for your soul. That anxiety, worry. Oh, and then the oppression that you're dealing with. Oh, this world system. Hallelujah. This world way, this beast system. It only leaves you broke, busted, and disgusted. Oh, but Jesus Christ is calling for all of mankind to come to him. Hallelujah. Surrender your life to him. Oh, many people, they love pride. They celebrate pride. But God can teach a woman how to be a woman. He can teach a man how to be a man. Paul said, when I was a child, I spake as a child. Oh, I understand as a child. But I became a man, I put away childish things. Oh, when will you put away childish things? When will you come to your creator? Come to the true and the living God. Oh, he's calling for you tonight. We don't come with no false religion. We don't come with no one save, always save religion. We come to the truth. We come to the, the gospel of our Lord and Savior. Oh, Jesus Christ is calling for you tonight. Tonight, the night of salvation. Why don't you come to him? Come to the true and the living God. Oh, he don't want religion. He want relationship. Why will you die in your sin? You can come to him tonight. 
The Bible says that they hear his voice. Harden not your heart. Oh, don't heart your heart. He don't want cult religion. He want relationship. He want relationship with all of mankind. Oh, he want to teach you tonight. The Bible says, hallelujah, today, you hear his voice. Harden not your heart. Let him come in and suck with you. There's only one way, and Jesus Christ is that way. And he's the truth. He's the life. There's not many ways to heaven. There's only one way to heaven. And Jesus Christ is that way. Oh, he's the truth tonight. Hallelujah. He's the life. No man coming to the Father except through him. Oh, many people think they got many ways. They think they can drink their way to heaven. How do they can fornicate their way to heaven? How do they can live in last seven? They can live in pride. Oh, but God hates pride tonight. The scripture says, how do repent and believe the true gospel of our Lord and Savior? Oh, come to him. He don't want co-religion. He don't want falsehood. He wants truth. But Jesus Christ is calling for you tonight. He's calling you. He's saying, come to me. Whatever age you are, whatever gender you are, he's saying, come to me. Come to me. Bring your brokenness to me. Bring your loneliness to me. Bring your anxiety, worry, or depression. Bring it to me. Glory to Jesus Christ. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. I'm just asking, like, you pray for me? Say what? You pray for me? Yes, sir. Pray, what do you pray for your body? Okay. What's your name? Michael. All right. Heavenly Father, in the name of Jesus, Lord God, thank you, Lord God, for Michael, Lord God. Pray, Lord God, to touch like never before, Lord God. I pray, God, you touch his mind, soul, and his spirit like never before, God. Help him, Lord God, with the pressure, the anxiety, the worry, the pressure that he have in his life, Lord God. I pray, Lord God, to continue, Lord God, to create him a clean heart and renew a right spirit in this life, Lord God. You say you call the young because they're strong. You call the old because they're wise, Lord God. I pray, Lord God, you touch his heart, Lord God. Touch his mind like never before, Lord God. Every stronghold tonight, Lord God. Had to flee at the name of Jesus Christ, Lord God. Oh, we thank you for tonight, Lord God. Out of the belly, out of the river, living water flow. In the name of Jesus Christ, Lord God, we pray. Amen, amen, amen. Glory to Jesus Christ. Glory to Jesus Christ. Thank you. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Praise the Lord Jesus Christ. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Jesus Christ is the only way. You must be born again. John 14 and 6. I want to talk to you. Why do you want to talk about? I don't know what you want to talk about. Jesus Christ is the only way. Amen, brother. You're truth and a lie. You got to be born again. Not, I am all kinds of born again. Oh, okay. oh we're talking Jesus. Let me know. Let me ask your question. What are you doing out here? I'm loving Jesus. You can't love Jesus and love the world at the same time. Yeah. First John 2 and 15 said, love not the world. The world Need loves. Need a thing in the world. You got to love the world. All that's in this world. You got to love the world. You can't love the thing in the world. You got to love, love the people and hate the sin. Jesus is all that. He's all the good stuff in the world. I love me, Jesus. I yeah. do. I do. Jesus, love Jesus, you know what? Jesus is why Trump is here today. Yes, he is. Uh, Jesus uh, said, if you love me, you'll keep my I commandment. I pray. Love one of my Jesus. Hear my but the first, the first one is to love the Lord with all thy heart, mind, body, and soul. That means you got to love him with everything. He don't you know want... What? What's this that? This is a good, very, very, very good message. I'm a very Catholic person. I read at church the whole bit. Have you ever but prayed to the Virgin Mary? Absolutely. Without a doubt. I'm Catholic. What? We do, we... Have you read the first commandment? Oh, you guys, you guys aren't going to read people have no that other way. Gods. You guys can't read people like Virgin that. Virgin Mary. You know how you reach people? people? With the truth. With love. We love y'all. That's why we're telling you. You reach people with love. Okay, think about this. If there was a truck. Hey, do you remember when Jesus died on the cross? Listen. Nobody's perfect. Remember he this. He died because he gave, he gave us the right to be human. But listen. And to, to, she he gonna fight for you for our life. sins. Listen. Do you listen to him? Listen, if I a truck. I know Jesus. I don't need your preaching. If a truck I was coming Jesus. at you 100 miles per hour, would you want me to run and kick you out the way to save your life? That kick would hurt. No, you know what? No, but you don't I don't know want you. I don't want you to get ran over. I don't want you to get ran over. So I would run and kick you out of the way to save your life, and that kick's gonna hurt. The word of God hurts. No, that, I don't 
I know you want that. For me, for me, I can't have my whole friends and family. You know what I believe? You know what I believe? I believe that Jesus loves me. He loves me in spite of my sin. And I believe that Jesus died on the cross for me because I am a human. And, a, and, 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 and you know why? He, he knows I'm, I'm going to fall short. And I tell him every night, I say, thank you, God, for doing that for me. And thank you, God, for forgiving me. Have a good night.